it's a E90 wagon, a 320i in Japan, right hand drive. Really dope. You don't see those a lot in the US. This thing is cool. Man. Guys, look at this amazing machine. Old school tires. Look at that. That's cool. I like this thing. Can I drive it? This is so cool. It's definitely been here for a while. But this thing is cool. Man, I like this thing. Charcoal gas engine car. What? That is so cool. Yep, and this is another one. Same model, different color. Guys, this is pretty insane what I found. A BMW E30, I don't know if it's a, an M3 or what, but this is crazy, like in the middle of nowhere. And uh, I just had to stop by, we're gonna go check it out, but that's pretty crazy, guys. Like literally, I saw it in the corner of my eyes and I had to stop. I honestly did not expect to find this car here, but I guess it's here, guys. Look at this car, it was wrecked. That is pretty crazy. Holy cow. I cannot believe what I'm seeing. Look at this. What happened to it? Just don't understand. Oh, look at that. There's a, a phone number and a Gmail. This is pretty insane. Some of this car is just taken apart. Guys, I can't believe this. Is this a real M3? I don't know. I'm not sure. And this is so damn sad. What happened to it? Why, why is it here and how long has it been here? It's got those BBS wheels and everything. Like that's, that's insane. That's pretty crazy guys. And there's like a bunch of like abandoned kind of uh, equipment here and uh, little just in the middle of nowhere. And there's another car right there, which we're going to go check it out. But I don't know what it says. That's pretty crazy. I guess that's the same kind of note with the phone number. This is pretty sad, guys. I don't know what to tell you. Should I leave a note on it? Oh, I mean, I do have their Gmail, so maybe I'll I'll send them a a letter or something. I don't know, but that's that's crazy. That's so sad. I want to see what's under the hood, but it's like I don't want to make it like too awkward here because there's some people right there just standing. But there's engine in there. It's got an engine and everything. That is just sad, it makes me wanna cry. Look at that intercooler right there. Oh boy. Man, this is this is insane. I'm gonna try to open the hood in a little bit, but that's, that's so sad. I'm pretty sure this is a real M3, guys. Look at the, the body style and then the fenders and then like the seats are super like sporty and everything. This is crazy, guys, this is so sad. 
Yeah, guys, I don't know what to tell you about this car, but I'm super, super sad. I'm gonna try to contact the owner. I don't know if I'll uh, give you an update in this video. Maybe I'll give you an update whether or not he responded to me. Uh, but uh, I'm not gonna, I'm pretty sure this is an M3, the real M3. I'm not gonna open the hood. I tried, but it's, it's locked and the car itself is locked. So um, I just hope that I can get in touch with the owner and talk to him about this car. I mean, this is so sad. And look at this bumper. Like, this bumper, like, probably costs, like, so much money. That's crazy. Like, and this car just, like, sits here abandoned. I mean, like, you still, like, there's a lot of nice, you know, classic hero cars in Japan. But there's also, you know, like, some cars like these that you see that also need help and revival. So, I feel like there should be another Vito here in uh, Japan who saves these cars. Uh, but I'm definitely gonna like check up on the owner and talk to him and find out some information about this car Because I literally I was just driving this way and then I saw this car and I had to turn around Yeah, I mean some people say that I have a pretty good eye. So I guess whoever says that you guys are right But here's the amazing baby girl right here BMW E30 M3 This is what this car looks like on this side there's like a rust hole right there but yeah i really you know i think i know what happened to this uh roof when they were picking this car up probably with like a gripplers or something that's what happened i don't know why they would do that that's pretty insane that's so horrible why would they just like pick it up like this and lift it oh my goodness that breaks my heart there's a, another engine from a nissan right here guys this is a real m3 engine this is crazy bmw m power right there i'm so sad i just still can't believe they grabbed this car and just did it this way why would they do that that's so sad oh my god Yeah, I'm gonna spend here another like 10 minutes staring at this car and I'm gonna leave and I'll talk to the owner sometime this week.